everyone happy sunday <laughs> and welcome to another edition of the sunday sunshine show brought to you every sunday morning at 7 30 a.m uk time is that gmt <laughs> i'm not sure um by four youtuber friends myself busy b marie who lives in las vegas Karen from Geordie Grandma and Maria Crocker. I will put all their links in the description box. So, what are we doing this week? Every, every Sunday morning we come on and we all do the same theme, but we just put out, we don't really discuss what we're doing. We just put our own slant on it. We just have a head in, um, usually. And although we do chat to one another all the time. <laughs> So today's theme is autumn is everywhere. I'm wearing orange, just. <laughs> well, it really is, isn't it? You go in the shops, you can't believe it because at the moment in the UK, well, in the north of the UK, it's really hot. Um, we've had a terrible summer and now we've got two really warm days. It was really warm yesterday, but autumn is everywhere. Everywhere you go, in the shops, and even in the gardens, um, you know, you can see the changes. Um, and that's going to be our theme. Um, could be anything, we could make, do an autumn recipe or whatever. It's all a mystery. So you'll have to go and watch the other girls' channels um, to see what they're doing. <laughs> so let me tell you what I'm doing. Well, what I've done is I've taken you on a tour around my local garden centre, the plant place. I'm often videoing there because it's such a lovely, lovely garden centre and they always do a lovely autumn display. So I've, they haven't got everything in yet, but they've got a lot, it's beautiful. So I'm going to show you around there and then around my garden <laughs> because I've noticed there's quite a lot of changes happened in my garden. Really, I would say over the last week, it, it's surprising, you know, the leaves are turning now and falling. So without further ado, let's get into the video. Hope you're all okay and I hope you're having a nice weekend. So here goes, let's go around the Plant Place Garden Centre to start off with. So I've just parked the car and this is just as I'm going in. Oh, don't the flowers look lovely? Sort of a wild border, it's really nice. They are extending it here. I think they're going to put um, some sort of restaurant or cafe in. Look at those beautiful, beautiful hydrangeas. I wouldn't like to think how much that cost. When you go in the plant place, you do have to walk in um, through the garden centre at the back here. As you can see, the cyclamen are all there, all ready for planting. It's changing, isn't it, to the autumn um, plants and the autumn colours. It's nice to see all the changes. Oh, these are beautiful, aren't they, Cyclamen? Always remind me of my sister-in-law because she always used to buy me one. The colours are gorgeous. Now we're heading into the store. Just look at the beautiful autumn displays. I thought this was a nice idea. It's a Christmas tree and they've trimmed it up for autumn. Doesn't it look nice? Maybe you could leave one out all year and trim it up for spring and then Easter, then summer. <laughs> I don't think I would. But it does look exceptionally nice. These are gorgeous, these leaves. Mm -hmm. 
The colours make you feel cosy, don't they? All the different pumpkins. Those brass mushrooms, look at those, they're nice. I wouldn't want to have to clean them though. I remember having to clean all the brass as a child. My mum used to have loads and loads of brass. I used to hate it. I thought these were unusual, the, the green pumpkins, they did look, they look very effective. But I think they were about $24.99 each, I did look at the price. I just feel I've got enough now, I don't really need any more. It's worth to store all these things. Or was it $26.99, I can't remember. I didn't film as much as I wanted to in there because um, my phone ran out. Little acorns. Some beautiful things. They're gorgeous, the glass pumpkins. You see, it says here that they've got more Halloween stock coming. I thought this was really cute. Can you see the little pumpkin house? Can you see there? And look inside. When you go inside, it's a hedgehog fast asleep. Isn't it cute, that? So nice. All the oranges and the greens and the browns, it looks lovely. So the next thing I thought we'd look at is autumn in the garden. Now, when I got up this morning, there was it was damp on the ground. Um, there was a heavy dew. It was a nice day yesterday. So we still got some roses out. Not many, but still a few. And can you see we've got berries on the honeysuckle? It's just that time of year. It's nice though, isn't it, to see all the changes. And the leaves are starting to turn. Can you see some leaves are starting? Still got some roses and lots of weeds by the look on uh, my big hedgerow rose. But you can see there some of the leaves of that creeper are turning red, which is nice. And the same here. It's nice to see all the changes. I 
And then of course we've got the apples. Lots of apples, I've taken lots off, but I can't um, reach a lot of them. They're really nice eating apples, these. But as you can see, if you look at the ground, it's proper autumn now starting, isn't it? You can see the fall of the apples. They're the ones that the wasps and the birds have been at. And the leaves are all falling. Can you see they've started to fall already? This is a grapevine, but and there are some grapes on it. They don't taste very nice though, so we don't really, we did try and take them off at one point, but they're very bitter. But it's getting a bit carried away, that grapevine, it's going all over the place, can you see? The garden things that need burning. all the apples on the floor these are the ones that are, are damaged you know there's still some I'm going to make some apple sauce and freeze it with them I'll make some things I'll probably show you on the channel not that you can see Rangers. Can you see they've changed colour? I love it when they go that sort of greeny colour. The hibiscus, can you see there? The hibiscus is still flowering. grown quite a bit that this last year and then this here is a bay leaf tree look how big it is well it was just a plant it's gone mad and then the rosemary so that's the autumn tour of my garden well early autumn look at that tree next door it's massive it's a beautiful tree but it does take all the sunlight out of my garden. Not now but later in the day it just casts a shadow. It's massive. Well I hope you enjoyed that little autumn tour around the garden centre and around my garden. Um, it's nice um, to see all the changes isn't it you know uh, particularly like if you don't live in the UK it's probably nice to see how we celebrate autumn. Um, we've always, I mean, I don't know whether, I think you probably do it in a lot of countries, but we always sort of have a harvest festival. Um, whether it's, you know, I don't know whether they still do it in schools, you know, but it, it's lovely, isn't it, when you all bring all your autumn produce and then it's distributed to people who need it. Um, so that's one of the things that we do in, in autumn in the UK. <laughs> 
So thank you so, so much for watching. What do you do for autumn, wherever you live? Uh, let me know and let me know if you've enjoyed this video and then pop across to the other girls' channels and watch their videos. So that's Busy Bee Marie, Maria Crocker and Karen from Geordie Grandma. Her channel's just called Geordie Grandma. I'll link them all. I'll put them on here and I'll link them in the description box. So thank you so much for watching. If you think you'd like to watch us again, uh, we're on every Sunday morning at 7.30 and please consider subscribing to all our channels. Um, we do try and work hard to, to bring these videos to you every week, you know, on top of all the other videos that we do. So it's nice to be appreciated and we love um, reading all your comments. Um, and so please pop across to the other girls' channels and I'll see you in my next video. Bye-bye. Give me a thumbs up.